We come on, this cuts. You can't look at this cutscene without <laughs> fucking. My wife I'm left me. Fucking house. announcement. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm you going to piss on the moon. <laughs> you can't watch this cutscene without <laughs> thinking of that. I, I can understand where the angry Sonic fans are coming yeah. from, but I don't think they should be angry about that. They're always like, "Oh my god, it's so overquoted. And it's like so t- like 2012 well, it's cringy. It's funny. It's, it's cringy humor." And, and, and I'm, I'm like, sure it's not. And I'm sure, as someone who has made something and had it quoted to me, I'm sure the. The Snap Cube dubbing team doesn't love being known for just Gabe. I'm gonna piss on the moon. Yeah, probably. You know, like I, so I think it goes both ways. And I think if we understand each other, <laughs> if we if we just talk if about we just things talk and talk listen, it out, you know, now walk it out, now walk it out. Now no, so what out. do I have left as as in this game? I have Aquatic Mine, I have the Pyramid Level. So I'm about halfway through the the is Hero the Story. Pyramid Level next, or is there a Tales Level before? The there should level? be a Tales Level next. There's fucking me 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 I can't wait till it comes up. I'm gonna just be I'm gonna just be fixating on it the entire time. No no commentary. Just no commentary. Just vibe. Just me 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 me. Did you get a haircut by the way? No. I was gonna say it looks. I like the way you styled it today. Thank you, man. So it's because you're seeing my early morning hair. So what happens? Is for all the uh, audio listeners, I'll, I'll explain. <laughs> Everyone's an audio listener, okay? <laughs> no, That's but it's joke. funny as fuck to say. <laughs> for all the audio listeners, um, I use pomade in my hair. It's like a, je- it's like a, it's like a, a, it's like a molding mud of sorts, but it's not that strong. It's like stronger than, like a. No, it's like weaker than a moose. I don't know. I got you. It I just, like it. It just holds in your hair, and it doesn't feel like there's anything in my hair. So I just slick it back. I slick it forward. I slick it back, and then it slick back like this. But then my hair kind of parts as it, as it like, dries fully, and the day goes throughout, and then it goes to the sides. But then when you see me, it's already parted like that. Gotcha. So yeah. But usually I, I do a full slick back because I'm Italian. Yeah, I'm not Italian. Yeah. Well. So also I don't rock any particular hairstyle. Okay. As it, you when know. you're Italian, you gotta rock a particular hairstyle, and it's slick back. It's a pompadour. It's a pompadour. Or it's a, a white tank top with, <laughs> I don't know. White tank top. With, with chain. With, with like the Tony Soprano cut. Yeah. Listen here, you fuck. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Have you ever watched Sopranos? Yeah, that guy uses a lot of homophobic slurs. You ever notice that? I mean, it was, it was a product of the <laughs> no, time. No, I know. I'm kidding. <laughs> well, I'm not kidding, but... No, you're being very serious. I'm Tony being Soprano very serious. Pretty, that he does say those pretty homophobic things, but, and uh, racist. But that's kind, of, you know, that's kind of the point. I feel it. It kind of is. Is that he's a he's an individual that just hates people. Yeah. Um. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You know, I was, I was, I've been telling people about this. I've been watching Malcolm in the Middle lately. Okay. Um. Came out in what 1999. Ended in like 2005, 2006. Mm-hmm. And I like to watch those shows and then think about, like, how well or badly things have aged, you know? Okay. Like, how I, I try to give it my own freaking score, you know, like, out of 10. Like, how how well has it stood the test of time? And I will say, I think Malcolm in the Middle, especially for his time, was, was a pretty, like, pretty progressive show. Probably. Yeah, it probably... They, they, yeah, they display a lot of, like, uh, like gay characters, to be honest. Really? Yeah. Um, they the only one like th- there's been just some weird jokes and everything like but I, I i give it an eight out of ten for like standing the test of time and everything um you know given when it came out and everything the only, i mean for fucking real dude the only things that i found to be a little insensitive that like uh, the, it's just like outdated stereotype was like there's one episode where malcolm uh is trying to get this girl's um like short story published in the paper like the the school's trying to censor it because it uses like uh you know curse words and stuff f-bombs and whatnot Mm -hmm. um so they're like oh you can't you know you can't put post that in the school whatever and it's like no but this is a personal story and it was really good and this is this person's actual experience whatever it's about it was like a thing about cat calling and everything okay um pretty progressive yeah it was you know pretty 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 based for that time i will say um if that is the correct verbiage, I don't that know. is as a youth myself, that is the, okay, correct, that's verbiage. the correct verbiage. There's a there's yeah. a there's an age gap between me and Addison where of about fifty years. Of about fifty years, yeah. I'm sixty I'm gonna get, eight. I mean, I was waiting on purpose, <laughs> and then it fucking pancaked me anyways. It's okay, man. Like you saw me wait, right? Yeah, I saw you wait, and then it just didn't. Okay, whatever. It's cool. I'm not worried about it, Teehee. Um, 
Sorry, I got too. I go on too many tangents sometimes, and I get lost in the sauce. No, you're fine. Yeah, she's trying to publish this story. Malcolm's defending her and stuff, and then he says it to his mom. He's like, "Hey, this, you know, this thing's happening, and I'm, and you know, I'm trying to do what's right and everything." And then the mom is like, "Oh, well, who's the girl?" And then he's like, "Oh, there is no girl. Well, she's she's a lesbian anyway." And then, uh, and then the mom is like, "Well, maybe if you brushed your hair, she wouldn't be, or something like that." And I'm like, "All right, <laughs> okay, Jesus Christ." <laughs> That was the one where I was like, oh, yeah. yeah, that was that's definitely one where where it did not stand the test of time. No, um, and then there's another, there's another, there's a so there's there's a side plot basically. The B plot of the story is always that the older brother Francis is like away at school. He gets sent to military school and then he runs away. He mm-hmm. like disowns himself from the family and moves to Alaska and everything. Um, and he's in Alaska, and he meets a woman there, uh, and they get married and everything. And then he's trying to make like adjustments to like the house that they live in, and then and then his wife is like, "Oh no, you can't make adjustments to the house. It's you know built on Native American land or whatever." Okay. Um. And then he's like, "Wait, really?" And then the, the there's like a transition, like a little slide, like a little whip transition. And then he 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 built a casino in the. <laughs> In the <laughs> definitely, which is definitely like, not aged well. Not no, no, uh, definitely like a uh, pretty incorrect. Yeah, <laughs> so <laughs> that was that was the Holy two. Shit. That was the two demerits that I gave it for uh, for those things. Honestly, as an eight out of ten, that's pretty strong though. Yeah, but that's the thing is that in in well, I'm oh almost my god, done with I'm, it. Like I'm I'm six, shaking. I'm six seasons in, seven seasons in, almost done with the show. Seven seasons total. Um. <laughs> it's fine, dude. I'm not worried about it. I'm gonna have to replay the level anyways. I'm not no, worried it's okay. About it. So yeah, just just it's it's, it's just for like the I'm second getting, playthrough, man. It's for the second playthrough. I'm getting fucking bamboozled right Ooh! here. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> fucking end of the level. I get fucking. You destroyed. might not make it to the end. I know. But uh, no, to finish that thought. Sorry. It, yeah, I I thought it was a a pretty good for the time show. Eight out of ten. Gotcha. For in terms of. You know, whatever. Oh, oh. oh my god, dude! I probably could have gotten a fucking A. Yeah, too. yeah. That's insane. That's fine. We'll go. We'll go back to it. But uh, as an actual listeners. show, I thought it was really good. So far, there hasn't been like a week episode, but there have been some episodes where like the mom's gaslighting is out of control, or like the kids are just being too shitty, and I'm like, this is like bad. Like this is like cartoonishly evil. Yeah, and um. You know, it is oh, an over, very over-the-top show and everything, but I, you know, sometimes it was almost like uh, annoying how over-the-top it was. But that's gotcha. my, that's well, my Malcolm. And, I think as a show, nine out of ten, I could see why it was popular. I also saw that there were a lot of kind of things that probably later became tropes and everything. Mm, like it um, inspired a lot of. Yeah, I could I could tell that there's episodes of other shows that were inspired by it. I I want to say it was the first. Oh shit, that's fine. Except for the fact that I'm gonna oh, you're die about here. To fucking drown. It's oh, fine. five, four. Ah, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. Shut up! Shut ah. up! Shut up! Shut up! Oh, I'm dead. His ass does not have. Well, that yeah. sucks. I think it was also one of the first Mildly like annoying. single camera sitcoms too. Really? Um, it kind of if if not the first, it popularized it for sure. Oh well, that's pretty cool. Which uh, which I quite like. Oh, I hate this level too. Yeah, this level I'm not as familiar with. I won't. How do you feel about the lie. space level where you gotta go on the asteroids and shit? Not that bad. Yeah, a lot I worse like as Rouge. It's to be the frank. last. Yeah, it's the last uh, Knuckles level, right? But it's it's really not that bad compared to this and to the pyramid. I remember being a lot more annoyed at those two. And you know, I gotta say, I'm I'm glad that you're playing these Knuckles levels. I I couldn't do it. Really? Come on. I'd be lost. I'd be getting mad. You know, I didn't have this game really growing up at all. I told you I played this at my buddy's place, right? Have I ever told you that? When? So I was being. When did I tell you, or when did I? When do you play? play? My, like what age? So when I was in first grade, um, I needed to be like babysat by my buddy and like his family, uh-huh. um, because my parents worked and like I went to school early and yada yada yada. Yeah. Right. And so, whilst we were doing that, his sister had, who I had a crush on, mm-hmm. um, and she was a few years older than us. Yep. She had a GameCube in Sonic Adventure 2, and I would oh, play shit. Like, Chow oh, Garden. One. Yep. Oh, uh, I would play, like, Chow Garden at their place, like, with her and whatnot. And that's how I really got into both the Sonic franchise and also this game in particular. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, so, I don't think it's in this room. 
because I keep getting fucking spooked by ghosties. You, you might be you might be getting a little ghost scared. Um, and uh, so, dude, the camera angles are like <laughs> fucking Resident Evil in this yeah, game. Yeah, they're they're a little silly in this uh, in this level. And so, um, we played through this, and that's how I really got into Sonic. And then my parents got me like Sonic Heroes for like the uh, the fucking whatever it was. I think uh, Sonic Xbox. Heroes might be my favorite Sonic opening song. Sonic Heroes. Sonic it's pretty good. It's Crush Heroes. 40 also, right? Uh, yeah, I believe Crush so. Crush 40 was like the they were they were the dudes Dude, for a they while. Were, they are the dudes. They still are. Yeah, that's true. You think I they're mean, still around? Are yeah, they still, they're still around. They're still performing. Uh, yeah. Oh, you I gotta mean, get the fuck out of here soon. No, I don't. Oh my. The upgrades down here. Uh, wait, really? Yep. You know, it did seem a little tucked away, so I could totally. Could totally see that. Oh, right you gotta here. fucking hurry! No, no, it's right up here. 